Hi, y'all. It's your boy, Boss P. This Boss P TV. We back at it. And we just gonna get right into it, man. Motherfuckers, motherfuckers beat the case and, 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 and their head get a little big on. Motherfuckers get a whiff of freedom and they start losing their goddamn mind on. You know what I'm talking about? If y'all ain't heard NBA Youngboy, after he got that not guilty verdict last week, he lost his fucking mind. He has gone out on a limb. He jumped out the motherfucking window and said that he is greater than than Tupac, all right? He says that he's the GOAT, and Tupac, who is dead, by the way, is mad as fuck. Now, um, I don't, I, I, I don't know if, like, like most of my listeners actually listened to Tupac. I don't know if they're from that era, you know what I'm saying? But this is one of the greatest lyricists of all time. You know what I'm saying? He's up there with Biggie and Nas in them. Like, the way um, NBA Youngboy is looking at it, he's looking at it by the numbers. You know what I'm talking about? I, I don't think he understands that back then the game was different. There was no social media back then. There was no streaming back then. None of that shit. You physically had to move units. You had to move physical copies of your master CD, which was your album, if you wanted to make money, if you wanted to sell records. You understand? You had to go to Tower Records. You know what I'm saying? You, you had to go to all the record stores. They had vinyls. They had CDs. They had cassette tapes. Like, motherfucker, it wasn't like today with the computer in this age. You physically had to move real units. You understand? So he's looking at it by the numbers. All right, now, so NBA Youngboy, 14.8 million Spotify monthly listeners. Tupac, only 13.5 million. Okay, whatever. He said, drop, I, he, he said, drop, I am Youngboy 2. <laughs> Tupac didn't drop, I am Youngboy 2. Obviously, Tupac ain't drop Youngboy 2. He's not Youngboy. You know what I'm saying? Has a song with Juice World. Has a song with Snoop. Like, born in 1971, born in 1999. Goaded year, 1971 was a trash year. Like, I don't know who put this shit out. I hope it wasn't NBA Youngboy himself who put this shit out. You know what I'm saying? Otherwise, this would be a travesty. And he needs to get slapped in the fucking face. Slapped in the fucking mouth because he's wrong. And he's disrespectful to the mother. One of the goats. He's not. Tupac ain't the goat. He's one of the goats. If you want to talk about the goats, you're talking about Jay, Nas, Pot, Big, all the motherfuckers from back in the day. NBA Youngboy, he's not a goat. NBA Youngboy ain't nowhere near a sheep, let alone a motherfucking goat. As far as lyrics and bars go, NBA Youngboy on a scale of 1 to 10 is a 2. Tupac is a 10. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't think motherfuckers understand just how nice Tupac was because they only play the bullshit on the radio today. They playing the Young Boy and the Dirk and the Kodak and all that shit. That shit ain't nothing compared to the Big Pac, the Nas music that was out back in the day. This era ain't shit compared to the old school era. You know what I'm talking about? And I'm not hating. You know what I'm saying? This is not conjecture. This is just real talk. Like, it is what it is. If you talking about, like, motherfuckers today don't sound like they went to school. They don't sound like, they, they just don't sound educated. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers from back in the day, they had real bars. What they got today is that Like, that shit ain't that. that, that, that that's, that's not real music. Not to me. That's not real bars to me. The one thing that the music of today does is amp you up. That's it. It don't move you in any other way. It don't inspire you to think. None of that shit. Tupac music it inspired you to think. You had to listen to that shit like, damn, heard what that motherfucker just said? Young boy ain't saying shit. You know what I'm saying? It's just pure garbage. But you know what I'm saying? I just had to put y'all on to this shit. If y'all ain't seen this shit, man, y'all y'all let me know how you feel about it. I hope, I hope young boy ain't put this shit out himself because uh, that would be mad disrespectful. But anyway, that's all I got for y'all on this uh, young boy saying that he's better than Tupac shit. You know what I'm talking about, but I'm talking to my bosses right now. I'm saying I'm talking to y'all. If you like what you're hearing, if you like what you're seeing, then I do recommend, suggest, ask that you do like and subscribe to the channel. At least that way y'all can remain up to date on when I drop all my latest videos. You heard? But yeah, man, that's all I got for y'all for right now. It's your boy Boss P. This is Boss P TV, and I'm out.